Hi everybody, it's me Nana. Do you like the little bunnies? I sure do. As soon as I stopped by my local uh, Dollar Tree and I walked through the door and I saw those little bunnies, well, as you know, I was hooked, right? And then I saw these little salt and pepper shakers with the bunnies and the chicks. Well, it was all over. I was really only in there to just pick up a few things. But as we do the little walkthrough, you'll see. See my little chicky in his little egg, in his little shaker ball? <laughs> well, I got him too. But look at all the eggs. It really was an extravaganza. This is my local Dollar Tree, much closer to my house than the other one. And they had just finished stocking. In fact, I, as I was uh, leaving, they were stocking again. And I got so excited. I was with my son and he humored me while we walked through. I whipped out my phone and I said, gosh, I hope I have enough time to uh, record all these beautiful things. I was just so excited. Really, I was only in there for one quick thing. Is it ever one quick thing? Well, I'll let you enjoy my little walkthrough and then I'll see you at the end because I want to show you what I actually brought home. So enjoy for now. Okay, so it's about, I guess, around 8 o'clock at night. Dinner's been done, and here we are with all my little goodies. Just a mini haul, the little things I, I just couldn't let pass up. And then some other things that, well, I have some ideas for. You know how that is, right? First of all, for, for the hubby who humors me, a handy chamois. Who, who doesn't need a handy chamois for a dollar? Well... We need a handy chamois for a dollar every day of the week. So then I saw this and I'm wearing them right now. And I have to tell you, they're great. I walk around the house with them. I wore them yesterday as I was doing my errands with my tennis shoes. They were perfect and they're so adorable, adorable. I can't believe it. I had bought some before, but these are great. These, these, the Dollar Tree ones surpass the ones I bought at another store. So guess who's going to get some more? And here we have some toys, pick up pairs. These are all things I'm going to make. Shh, be quiet. I'm going to make them for my grandson for Easter. Uh, they're going to come out of their package and I'm going to, you know, put them in their own little container that is handmade by Nana, of course. And, you know, <laughs> we're going to put a little spin on it. He loves his turtles, his Ninja Turtles, and I loved my color forms when I was a little girl. I bought some extras too because you never know when you're going to need them. And this, of course, for my granddaughter. And it's not complete without Frozen, right? Frozen. I love it. I, I don't know why I love it so much. And here is again for my grandson for this Easter. Nana's going to put a little spin on it. You can come along while I make it. I'll show you. For a dollar, we're going to turn this into just the most wonderful time killer for him. And he'll enjoy it because Nana made it. And you know, it's just that much extra special. And who knew in a dollar, to in a dollar tree, right? <laughs> Here's the little bunnies. They're the ones that hooked me on my little trip that turned into about an hour. <laughs> yep, it was an hour. And look at my bunnies. Now, I'm really careful because they're not really going to be salt and pepper shakers now, are they? We know that. They're going to be included in something else. And this, uh, the lady told me, this is from last year. And they brought it out of some boxes that they keep them in. It was only 50 cents. But... Here's our Easter bunnies. They only had three. I wish they had more because, you know, I just can't get enough. They are hands down adorable. The, the video does them no justice. They are just cute beyond words. I just can't believe. I, I don't even know that I'll do anything with them. They're just beautiful the way they are. And I was there for those clay pots. That's what I was there for. <laughs> And then I remembered 
Abel Lee and I have an appointment because he taught me this. I'll have to put a link below. It's a little case he made and he was fortunate enough to have a better uh, set. I'm kind of going to have to wing it because I don't have the double set like he got, but I'm still going to attempt to make it. Abel Lee, shout out. <laughs> I'm going to do it. I told you I would. Now I have the stuff and we're going to get it done. I got about five uh, total, but this will be uh, my foam uh, liner inside. I'll explain much more later, but uh, again, here we are with some ribbon. Who can turn down ribbon? And I couldn't turn down the bunnies. I was really in a bunny and chick mood this trip. Now, these are nice and glittery. You get 12. They're good for cards. They'll be good for all kinds of things and, and uh, probably my grandson too. And again, I said I went chick crazy. These are those window decorations. But like last year, I believe I'm going to put them in some picture frames just to add some Easter fun. And this is part of a set. This is a train. I didn't even realize it until I looked at the window. And look at that train. Look at that. Isn't that just screaming Easter? Easter eggs and Easter chicks. <laughs> I am so excited. Okay. Easter eggs and Easter chicks supposed to be in the window, but we know where that's going, right? That's going in a, um, that's going in a photo frame. Six stickers in all and adorable, adorable. I, I can't believe I paid a dollar for them. And Mr. Hoppity Hop. I, I love the hoppity hop of Easter and, uh, Look at that. Even on a window, if you want to just put that on a window or, oh, I've put them also on mirrors in the bathroom when my uh, boy was just a little sprite, little boy. Uh, gold egg picks. I have not seen these. You may have them in your area, but because this was brand new put out, I got excited and hop on in. We, I hadn't seen these before either and the happy Easter chick. So I got my uh, hoppity hop and I got my Easter chick and goodness knows where they're going to go, but my house is going to be ready for Easter. I know I'll be ready. I hope you'll be ready too. And remember, don't forget to bring that color into your life because Easter's coming and spring is literally around the corner. I enjoyed this today and I I hope you did too, and I will see you again later. Thanks so much for watching. Bye now.